Hello and welcome to JPR Arts Tips and Tricks. In this episode, we will teach you how to create an out-of-bounds effect for your image. First, you need to copy the background layer by selecting the layer and dragging it to the Create New Layer icon. Then, you need to select the background layer again by clicking on it and then create a new layer above that by clicking on the Create New Layer icon. Now, you need to select a new color for your new layer, so click on the eyedropper tool and select a nice color from your image. After that, click on the gradient button and hold down your mouse so the menu flies open and click on paint bucket tool. Now, move your cursor to a spot somewhere in the image and left click. Your new layer should have a new color now. You can check this by clicking on the eye in front of the top layer to hide this. Don't forget to click on it again to reveal it after you checked. Now select the top layer again by clicking on it and create a new layer like you did before so the new layer is on top. You need to create the boundary now so a part of your image will pop out. So click on the rectangular marquee button and drag your rectangular with the top layer selected. Then you need to click on Edit and choose Stroke. A new window will pop open. Set the stroke to 50 and choose White as color. Also make sure location is set to Inside. Now hit OK. With your selection still active, click on Select and choose Inverse. You need to expand the selection so the part that's out of bounds is also selected. So click on the Quick Selection Tool button. Now hold down Alt and paint on the part you want to add. After that, select the layer below your top layer and while holding down Alt, click on the Add Vector Mask button. Now you need to click on the boundary layer at the top to select it and choose the Eraser tool and erase part of the boundary. You just have to create a nice shadow now, so select the correct layer and click on the Add a Layer Style button and click on Drop Shadow. In the new window, just change the size and click on OK. We want to copy this layer style to the boundary layer, so hold down Alt and drag the layer style to the boundary layer.